I love South Park. South Park Joining the Pandaverse is random directed by Trey Parker, also stars him in Matt Stone and uh, Janesha, uh, Janesha, Janesha Adams Janyard. If you are watching this, I am sorry. It tells the story of Cartman's deeply disturbing dreams portrayed the end of the life he knows and loves. Meanwhile, the adults in South Park are wrestling with their own life decisions as the advance then the advent, sorry, of AI is turning their world upside down. Hello, you we are beautiful movie lovers. My name is Lou Aiken, movie fan, and today we are talking about the new South Park special, which is basically a movie, South Park Joining the Pandaverse, and if you were like me and many other video, and, and every uh, and every other people, uh, uh, we were all thinking, South Park is missing, and there was even a video, video that came out, well, like, last month, and, uh, yeah, <laughs> I, I guess the moral of the story is, um, wait, <laughs> at least, um, but yeah, uh, anyways, uh, this is a new special, uh, from South Park, uh, which is basically a movie, I don't care, I'm counting it as a movie, and, um, as you may know, in, I believe, 2020, or, I, I believe so, 2020, uh, they signed a contract with, um, Paramount Plus to make, uh, specials for, uh, 14 specials for Paramount Plus, so basically one at least a year, so, yeah, and this is the recent entry of that, which is basically mocking people who basically do nothing, and also forced diversity, particularly Disney, honestly, because, um, that is hilarious, uh, and overall, I just gotta say this, this is hilarious. I mean, genuinely. South Park knows what to do. I mean, genuinely. Whether it's commentary on the world or just comedy itself, they do an amazing job with it that it's not just an animated character just saying the frick word the entire time. I mean, genuinely. And I just love South Park for that. And this is another great entry in it. I mean, genuinely. Uh, I, oh, the humor obviously is hilarious, and the animation, like, always is great, I don't know, I just love the style of South Park so much, and obviously the humor is great, yeah, and the characters we know and love doing what they normally do with some different stuff. Uh, Cartman in this one is maybe some of the, is some of the best he's ever been, honestly. Um, I mean genuinely, and... Honestly, it's kind of, uh, different by the end, if you will, um, d even though they'll probably just change that, but, uh, yeah, I mean, genuinely, uh, and also, uh, him, I, I don't know why, but I just loved him being in an alternate universe <laughs> of diversity, I don't know why, I just, <laughs> just couldn't help but laugh, I mean, genuinely, and also the shots they take at Disney are just great, but also they don't just take shots at Disney, but also people like geeks and gamers, or the critical drinker, you know, assholes like that, that, uh, you may probably hate like me, um, but, yeah, um, and, um, yeah, and they, I like that they both make fun of both sides, honestly, basically saying none are kind of in the right, if you will. I mean, genuinely. And also makes fun of their remakes also, which I just couldn't help but laugh at, especially with Bambi, which I just couldn't help but, uh, find funny. And also the, um, subplot with, uh, the adults in S South Park, um, basically being very pissed off because not a single handyman is available, and it is the funniest thing ever. I was starting to think that, oh god, is this gonna get old? And it just didn't. It just got funnier, and I just loved it. Um, I mean, genuinely. And it's just, I don't know. I don't really have much to say. This is basically more quick thoughts. Uh, but overall, yeah, I did enjoy this special, which is a movie... Um, but yeah, I, I enjoyed it, um, I don't really have that much to say, I don't know what to say that's already been said, and aside from the COVID specials, this may be the best South Park special, 
um, at least in this modern era. Uh, but yeah, I enjoyed, uh, this. I would highly recommend it. It's on Paramount Plus, obviously, and, uh, yeah, I would recommend checking out. Overall, I give South Park joining the Pandaverse, uh, an A minus. So those are my thoughts on uh, joining the Panda first. I love ending, by the way. Did you? Wh what did you think about this? Uh, did you love it? Hate it? Let's agree, disagree. Download comments. Come and tell me. Uh, yeah. Um, I will probably have a review for when evil lurks. Uh, tomorrow morning maybe, and uh, and also November. Uh, has a lot of stuff. I may try and play, play catch up. Uh, I'm I'm planning to uh, pay play uh, uh, catch up on some new releases I missed, so maybe I'll review some of them, like the Royal Hotel, um, and also Pain Hustlers, which I'm just not gonna have the time to watch probably, or then I'm just not in the mood for it. Maybe, um, maybe I will, but I I don't know. Uh, we'll just see, and also I'm excited for December, and also the end off that month and the beginning of January. I know it may be early saying that, but it will be kind of busy, just to say. Uh, but yeah, that's it right now for me. Yeah, stay awesome!